Greetings and welcome back to Timberborn. I'm Catherine of Sky, and oh my goodness, we have issues here. Um, our water that we have left over is a tiny fractional amount. And um, I don't know if we actually lowered that water level or what, but it is no longer getting to the higher parts of this uh, area. So I think we need to actually dig a water um, a water hole uh, somewhere here. We can count it out. Let's just use our chopper here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, 12, 13, 14. So I was thinking somewhere here along the road. Uh, and I think that's a good idea. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Let's put it right here. Uh, right there. Okay. We'll put in our little dynamite there. And this should help us keep this area green. Now, did I add... I don't think I actually added any bread processing stuff here. And I feel like that's kind of important to do. I feel like it's really important to do, in fact. Um, let's get the... Um, I would like to add another layer of warehouses here. So firstly, let's try and get that happening. See, one can go here. Another can go uh, maybe there. Uh, mm. That is not what I envisioned. <laughs> uh, we could delete these we could delete these blocks they weren't they aren't actually needed so i don't like using um terraforming for this or explosives for this but eh, it's okay i guess but then that's gonna mess up this road issue here no i think we want to delete this We'll leave this bottom section as it is because what we need, what we can do here, is just put in another one of these here, right? Maybe this one goes up top. Maybe that's a better idea. Okay, we'll do that instead. We'll just put in a little bridgey, bridgey, not bridgey, bridgey, but a platformy, platformy. That doesn't have quite the same ring, does it? Platformy, platformy, not really. Okay, let's chuck this over here, and then again over here. So the only issue, though, right now is the same issue we were having before. When you are stuck in this kind of design where it's like, ah, yes, let's have a grid, then you have the inability to cross the grid. But we don't actually, no, we don't actually have that issue because the underneath parts are connecting and the road is on top. So that is actually working. So we did not confine ourselves to the grid as in, Instead of um, building a road over the road, we have buildings over the road, and that's much better. Okay, so now more warehouses, otherwise known as building platforms. Yay! Uh huh. So this, well, we can actually add more here as well. And this one needs a road as well. And then I want to zero all of those out, too. Let's get this one going there. And little thingy and thingy thingy. Good. So let's zero all of these warehouses out real quick. Because we don't know what we want in them yet. Uh, but we do know that we want some grain happening. So let's get the grain going. We need, remember, two grist mills per each uh, bakery. Or how do I want to do that? I don't want to do that. We could do this and have like a paper mill on the other side or something. What is the other one that has, is it a sideways one? I think it's the print, no, it's not the printing, it's a paper mill. This way, yeah, there we go. That works, except it doesn't work because it doesn't straddle this area. Hmm. No, that does not work. Dang it. 
So that's not going to work. We need we need to have multiple thingies there because uh, that's not working at all. Put this out there. We could put in the bakery and stuff, maybe. I guess that would transmit power, right? Yeah, I would. So if we did this and had two bakeries, okay, and then we had a grist mill and the paper mill, that would work. We also need a thingy here. So let's get paper mill here. Okay, so let's make sure these are going to make wheat flour. Since we don't have any cattails yet, these can make maple pastries and these will make bread. And that will make our people a lot happier, really happy. Um, we also want to put in, let's do the decorations real quick as well. Oh, this is not, not ideal. Okay. Actually, let's do these two and these two. That will work. Mm-hmm. Uh, all right, and bush. That seems so dumb, but it, yeah, it, it works, it works. Get them while they're at work, might as well. Okay, this is going really nicely. Look at this, this is fantastic, dang. Let's put this on high priority here. Hello? Autosave? Okay, thanks. Thank you, autosave. Ah, but we also need road. That would be helpful. So to get on top of these, now that, that was the other question that I was thinking about. How do we go up here? Because we really would like to have the main area be up here and cover these roads with other platforms, really. Okay, so how do we do that? What is a very nice, elegant way to get up here? And where do we want the road, more importantly? We could have it there. We could just put a sideways thingy here and that would work. We could do that there, that would be fine. Do like this way and then road there that would give us our threes mm-hmm that would work this could have if we did this let's see do we need that let's find out for the grill the grill, it does not need this. Uh, but we can put it anyway, because we can have a shrine or tooth grinding or whatever. In fact, that's a good idea, I think. We'll do some tooth grinding here. Mm hmm There we go. Have them all facing different directions, so nobody is impinging on anyone else's privacy. This will be uh, potatoes. Okay, what are you meowing about? Oh, you don't have any trees in range. Of course you don't. Uh, wow, these trees have been deleted, completely decimated. Okay, um, let's pause. Want to delete these trees? Um, how far the farms go quite far, but I don't think I want to take them that far. I think I would really like to get these trees deleted. Do we, we can't actually reach those, can we? We can reach some of them actually, very few. Are those cutting orders? They are, okay. So let's see, this one, ah, go Kami, hello. You need to get working, dude. You really need to get working on this. What I think I wanna do here is cancel the plant crops thing here because I want to make sure that we get this forestry in here somewhere, and I don't know where that's going to be. Might be. It's really difficult to see for me here. Is there, a, is there like a, you can delete tree vision? Hello? Can we turn off trees? Global view? No, I really wanted my global view back. Pardon me. God, that was horrible. Where did it go now? 
I don't know where it went. Okay, let's go back to Blueberry Falls. I can find it from there. Wait, where are we in Blueberry Falls? Oh, God. I see. So, hmm. so I wanted to do tree view. Is there a tree view? We have land, we have water. I could have sworn there was a thing to not show trees, wasn't there? I don't remember. Anyway, it's difficult to tell here what we have with the land thingies. Uh, yeah. Okay. Oh, why does it not show me, like, land formations? I don't know. I think we just need to delete the trees. Get the trees deleted. It will be fine. Everything will be fine when the trees are deleted. They are the enemies. We know this. Okay, so we have... Let's see. Two jobs unfulfilled. I'd like to do a... Add in a couple more people here. So that means we have four jobs unfulfilled. So let's move this up to ten. Okay. We also have no replication in this colony at all. And that is a tiny problem. So what we need to do is make sure that we have blueberries somewhere. I'm considering making this like maybe we make a little uh, um, water dump up here. That might be a good idea so that we can have a blueberry field somewhere. Um, alternatively, maybe maybe we just delete these trees and make a small blueberry area. That would work. That would actually work. Okay. Let's do that whenever they are harvested. I don't want to waste the wood. Though, how much wood do we actually have? I think we probably have enough. Do we have enough? Let's see. We have also the energy is just struggling. Okay. We... Yeah, we started out with... Oh! This battery... Starts out with energy. Eh? How does that work exactly? Let's put this on, on also on high priority. Somehow we're missing a gear there. So I guess the batteries start out with energy. I thought you had to fill them up. Maybe you do after you place them or something. I don't know. So these are 22,000. This one is 26,000. Okay, so the higher you build them, the better. That's for sure. And they do say that, of course, in the tooltip. But I didn't know how much uh, incrementally it would be to build them higher. Uh, did we get the number cruncher yet? Not yet. Okay. This is a thing that we definitely want on second high. Uh, it's going to take a lot of gears. I think, yeah, we have a lot of gear makers. Well, a lot in quotation marks. But, yeah. All right, beavers, let's go. Go, 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 go. Build. Build all the things and all the stuff. Yeah, this is not convenient. All right, detonate this. All of the crops here have died. This is very bad. So let's add this quick, quick. Because this needs to be... Oh, now we have, we have green again. Hooray! Okay, let's delete these things. Detonate. And then we can delete this thing as well. <sighs> okay. Um, eh, that's just faster to click it manually. That's pretty dumb. Okay, let's see if we can just finish off this area. It didn't hold as much as I thought it would. That was a surprise, a tiny surprise for me. Looks like the water blocks are hidden because I don't see them and I, I don't think you can destroy them either. So, anyway. But yeah, we do actually have this water thing functional, which is great. Just put this on high priority if we can. Thank you, thank you. Okay, water dump is in place. Perfect. That's getting done. I want to make sure that that... Uh, no, no. Oh, they have it. They just didn't build it yet. Okay, and then this is this is getting built. This is doing pretty well. We just need planks, which we have none of. 
we kind of need to have um, more power lines down here, but I'm not sure how or what that is going to look like. Uh, we can make our own power down here. That might be a great idea, actually. Maybe we delete these trees and just have power wheels going up and down here. Can we, we can shove it through here and then go straight through there. That would work nicely. Let's see, let's do a cutting thing through this entire area. This is a mess and a half. Oh my God, this is terrible, absolutely terrible. What is this? Okay, let's get, how are you functioning? Can you get down there? No, you cannot get down there. So let's get you down there. Once all this is cleared up, then you can do other things. Okay, and then this also has no thingy. Can you get down there? Yes. Okay, good. And then we'll put in, probably from this side, I guess we have to go up to there. But yeah, we need to, we're going to start building some major water projects in here, I see. I think, I see. I think it's going to be great. I think we could even do a zigzag of water thingies. That could be weird. It could work, though. It could be interesting. Stranded. Who's stranded? Where? Why? Dude! What are you doing? Where are you? Lyle. Yo. How is Lyle in the middle of a structure? Oh my god. I don't really get that. How do we get him out? Because, like, he's on this level, which we have a road to. Okay, all right, fine. Let's just delete everything, and you'll fall to the ground and hopefully get out. There you go. There you go. Don't die. Stop dying. It's not cool. Not cool to be dying like this. Okay, log storage. Let's go back again. And then here, there, and then top. Okay. We had to delete a lot of our logs. That actually was probably a really bad idea. But we don't want to like hurt our beavers. Beaver life is more important than log life. Yeah, for sure. Well, I don't know. Actually, trees can communicate with each other. They are really. It's a really. There's a really wonderful documentary, and this is based on science. Uh, I mean, it is science. Uh, it's, I think it's called The Secret Life of Trees or something. It is phenomenal. If you have never seen it, I highly recommend you check it out because it is like you would never have thought. It's fantastic. Where trees communicate with each other via chemical signals. It's pretty interesting. Pretty, pretty interesting. Okay, so this is, how is this going? Are we not able to get down here? Ah, I see. Okay, so... Why don't we just do a staircase here? Mm hmm Good, good. And then what? What do we have? Okay, this number cruncher is just waiting on gears. Okay. Power. Do we want to get an engine? Mm. Kinda. Actually, it's summertime or a wet season, so let's turn off these guys. Again, I would love to have some kind of circuit conditions that you could put in and that would automatically do stuff. Engines. Do we want one of those? Probably, I guess. I kind of hate the idea of an engine, though. Like, I really want to be using the water power that we have. Are we gaining from this? We are slowly gaining up. They are growing we're going up, which is great. What is going on here? Why are why is this crap not done yet? Oh, because it isn't. I see. Okay, so that is probably paused, or it should be paused. We need to get these staircases out of here. And then we can put in our water wheel. Rotate. There we go. Boom. Let's put that up. This is funky cool. I like this. It's kind of great. Kind of wondering if I should do that, like a zigzag around here. That would be kind of cool. I think it would require a lot of um, digging because this is a one tile depth. 
And that would need to be dug to at least two tiles. Okay, we have water, but we don't have water storage. Oh, whoops, we kind of forgot that part, didn't we? Let's put it uh, here somewhere. We can put it... Where's the entrance to the water thingy? I should memorize this, you know. I really should. So it long-wise would be best. Okay. I don't know. We have this damn tree here. Dang it. Ah, oh, those are so annoying. Those trees. So we need to have this here. Okay. So, all right, let's, this is so stupid, this area. Uh, let's go ahead and upgrade the thingies here. We need to cut these trees here. These are already on a cutting program. Great. Get these out of here as well. I don't know if that changes anything or not. But I would like to build... Hmm. How would we do this? Could we do... where is there water flowing from where here? This seems to be still water. And slightly going out to the world. It's hard to see what it's doing. It's doing nothing, mostly. Okay, so that's just going outward. Is there any water? Oh, there is water flowing down from here, but it does seem to be kind of a, yeah, just flowing out this way mostly. Um, I think what we do, oh, there's so much space here. It's nice. What we could do, I think I kind of want to try the zigzag approach here. It will be slightly annoying, but it will be okay as well. Um... So if we choose a wide enough point, we have to have five wide. One, two, three, four, five. So we can start here, technically. This is one tile deep. So what we need to do, let's plan this. Let's just plan the workings of this right now. Okay. Um, all right, let's take dynamite. This is going to be our first water wheel here. Okay. Okay. And then we're going to have a, a wall, levy, up here. And this is where the thing is going to sit, the stanchion thingy. Uh, all right. We need to have two of these because... No, we need to have more than two. Oh, God. Uh, that might be a bad thing, actually, using up this much real estate. Because if the water goes like here and around, you have to have one thing for the power line and then one for the, um, the block. But, hold on. This is one, two. We need, if we had seven, we don't have seven, though. We don't actually have seven. We could do it with just two, but we would need seven wide, and we do not have seven wide right now. That is a slight problem. So I think the better option here, at least until we have seven, this is seven here. And then we could do a two wide thingy thingy. Okay, so if we have this water flowing here, uh, yeah, that's fine. Then it will go around. We have the shaft is going to be here. Actually, we can delete some of these that are not needed. That's fine there. Uh, shaft is going to be here. And that's going to go to this shore. Uh, and here we take one of these guys and take again the shaft there. 
Okay, so now water is flowing. Okay. Then we have one divider. We have to have a divider. Okay. That's going to go all the way here to have like one gap or two gap. I'm not sure what is needed there. Uh, also, this, this needs to be dynamited as well. Quite a lot of this area. But again, trees. Too many trees right now. I wonder how, if this is close enough to actually work on it. Probably is. But we definitely need to kill a lot of these trees up here. I think we'll issue cutting orders because there's a lot of them. Uh, and I don't really want to waste them. We can just have temporary lumberjacks and such and things. And then let's get some of this shore, the shore trees out of here as well. Like two layers of shore trees or something. And then the rest we can leave alone for a tiny bit anyway. Let's see. Yeah, we have a lot to do here, but not a lot of people. Well, we have two vacancies. Let's go ahead and migrate. This auto-migration thing doesn't seem to be doing anything. I don't really get it. Like, I just don't really understand this at all. So here in Wetsburg, uh, Wetsburg, pardon me. Cannot be saying it improperly. Uh, all right. Um... So these, this farmer, okay, just needs to have uh, places. Oh, okay, the trees are done. Trees are done. Okay, this is great. So what we want with the tree, tree lands, I think what we want to do here is we can get the forester up here. The forester, well, maybe the forester is, is better here. I don't know. I kind of want to use this area for the road. So that we don't, like, use up all of our wonderful green land for road. Uh, um, and then, let's see, are we gonna... Can do something like... No... And then we can do, like, the rest of this can be foresty. Forester here. No, we can't. Because it is going to eat into the mountain. Actually, we can eat into the mountain. That's okay. We can do eating into the mountain just fine. Thank you very much. We have the technology. Um, yep. Yeah. Let's just take this road back here. And then we can also have uh, this coming down. So the forester can plant all of these areas over here. And that gives us the opportunity to move that one or change it or whatever. Do we want to have the tappers shack out here? Not really, I think. Um, I don't know, though. Let's see. This can also be done. That sound that looks really stupid, but it's okay. Um, and then here course we want to do the blueberries I think so let's see this can go down that way and how do we connect it up to here do we just do a simple yeah I think that's what exactly what we do we do a a little this is like the land of bridges it's kind of cool or land of staircases really yep that will be fine that would be fine uh, mm. so this, this building is going to move basically over here. Is this, I oh, know it does need four squares. It does actually need four squares. So we'll delete these guys. We'll put these up higher priority, I think. And then we'll, um, get those going. I hope that works fairly well. Do we have the mixed forest here? I don't think so. I think we should just do the maple forest, uh, for cutting purposes. Uh, we can actually put in our cutters up here as well to waste less space. I think that's a good idea. Why not? There we go. 
on the brown area. And then now we can plant our maples once again. And the other uh, forester can fill in for a bit on this. Wait, what? Uh, oh, we need to go here as well. Well, dang. Oh, you know what? We'll just put a simple staircase there. I think that will work quite nicely. It's a nice big area that we can have crops. Okay. Very good. Very good. All right. So now uh, we also can reclaim this area for planting. We kind of... Yeah. Yeah, we want to do that again. Maple. Wait, are these not maples? They're not! Oh, God, why? Why did I do this? All right, these also get deleted. These are maples, right? I think. Just make sure we click it and click it again. Are these maples? Yes, those are maples. How did that do that? How did I make that mistake? That's terrible. Absolutely terrible. Anyway. Oh, wow, we're, we're actually getting some of this stuff done? That's nice. Very nice. Uh, what we do need to do, though, is take these bridgey bridgies out here. Is that height two? I guess it is. Uh, so we can actually get some stuff done. Very important to get stuff done. Or maybe that was placed over here, that edge. I don't know. Um, what we're going to do, though, is we need to have... So let's delete this and then do stairs. Kind of just going to go on to each area. And this will need... Actually, let's delete this first and then we'll put stairs there first to build these. Oh, we don't need stairs. Of course not. Why would we need stairs? Um, get dynamite here. That's perfect. Yeah, and then all of these trees and crap over there. Because those are not needed. We'll put that there. And then this. Is that above the water? I can't even tell. Uh, let's see, T. Is that going to be that height? No. It's one down from that height. What I could do is build the lumberjack place here. Hmm. After this whole thing is complete, obviously. All right. Let's let that go. Let's let it do its thing. Um, and we can probably try to figure out how to get a high power shaft all the way down here. Ah, it's a bit wild. Just wild. Let's see, we can start by building a storage thingy here. And platformy bits around here. Okay, we also... Did I come up with storage space for any of this stuff? I'm guessing not. Let's see, we want to have our bread. This is going to be the maple pastries. Uh, this one is wheat flour. Okay. Hello, Wiley Coyote. How are you doing? Let's see, here we have paper mill. So let's put paper in here. I think what we're going to do with this paper, by the way, is we're going to have books made out of this i think that's the other building we are going to put in here let's put in books making because that's always nice printing press yay oh it's too long okay no worries though it fits absolutely perfectly here isn't that nice okay let's get that in here sneak it on in printing press there we go beautiful and that way, the denizens here of uh, whatever this town is called. Eh. Uh, it's called Blueberry Falls. Then they can do their stuff and their things. That's great. So let's see. Science. Do we have that new science -y thing working? I don't even know. It is working. 
nice oh my god and it doesn't even require an employee holy fuzzy cats this is great okay wow and we actually have a lot of excess employees as well um hmm that makes me think we probably should build another builder's hut or something. I think we have enough number crunching happening that we don't need another one. I'm not sure though, but I think we don't need one. So that means we can make other stuff like mud baths and other beautiful things that our beavers can enjoy. Um, and also monuments. Let's build another... Uh, place over here a builder's hut there we can go ahead and plant back those bushes here uh oh i like to kind of have the ground black here so we'll just let that happen wait what why is this one oh I think, yeah, we were going to do something different there, but we didn't. We're just going to plant back that, those carrots. I was going to say that corn, but it wasn't corn, it was carrots. And housing, labor. No, not labor. Yes, labor. No labor. Wait, labor. Yeah. Builders. Yes. Good. Go, go, go. Workers, four. Okay. So now... We actually have the opportunity to do some other things. And I want to start making golems and things like that. Uh, do we have enough metal blocks processing? I don't think so. We have 53 right now. But I have a feeling that's going to get eaten quite quickly. Quite quickly. So, let's see. What I think we can do is... We can continue our warehouse storage solutions here, uh, like this, potentially. Mm -hmm. And then put in extra uh, platforms here on the side. Oh god, really? Why are we... Why are we suffering with this? Help! Eh. I don't know if... This can be reached by the... Oh, it, it can be reached. How nice. So let's do a cutting order on these guys because we actually took that off earlier because we thought we wouldn't need it. But we do. We do. Hooray. We need the things and the stuff. Okay, let's zero these out. I, I kind of wish they would come default zeroed out. Now that we have new things, this is great. We can demand even more things. See, this is how game <laughs> game development works. Once the audience gets what they want, they want more. Yes, I'm just saying. All right, and so we're gonna do something different with this staircase here. Um, we're gonna change that a tiny bit and do something different altogether. We also need a road here. And this also can be a road. But this, hold on. Oh yes, that's perfect. We can have our stairs here. And then this can also be there, that's fine. Uh, okay, so then we can just add these over the roads we have. And we're quite clear with ourselves what we have and what we don't have. That is excellent. Yes. And more storage can be here. I really like this storage solution that I came up with, like doing the other one with that giant reservoir and stuff like that. That was pretty interesting. Kind of fun for me to do. Uh, okay, so how do we want the roads to go here? We haven't actually decided this yet. Probably in threes, but we need to alternate them. A tiny bit I think like this so that we have power going from warehouse to thingy actually initially we don't need that that power at all do we no we can we can deal without that okay power no 
want to do this and grab it by the railing. This was always such a strange thing that the railing is so difficult to target or so tiny to target. Oh, no, we do actually need this because if we connect the power to these guys, then we can we need to connect it over here. But but not needed and not needed because we can have a tiny shaft going this way. I think that's important. Let's do that instead. I think that tooth grindstone is not going to fit underneath a small power shaft like this or a short power shaft. I think it requires more. Okay, so these, whatever's here, will be powered there. And then do I go across? I don't know if I need to go across. Let's go underneath and see what's going on down here. Okay, let's go down. So... We can actually have this one, delete that one, and put stairs there if we want to. Oh, wait, where are the stairs going? Ugh. We need to have them going... I don't know which way. Uh, not that way. Clearly not that way. But one of these ways. We can do that somehow, magically. I think this way, yeah? Yeah, that's a thing. That is something. I don't know if it's a good thing. It's something. <laughs> okay, so this will go here. And now what I would like to do is connect the power across. We can actually do something like this, where if we put in something like a, a grist mill, like here, that connects all of these things together. But do we... Hmm. This is probably not a necessary road, so we should take it out. If it isn't necessary, we don't need it. We don't need to have it here. So that would be better to take out. Here, we... I think we need to do some something else here. I don't know what we're going to do there. We probably... So this is covering the non-anything area. What were we going to add here? Was it the metal stuff? I think it was metal stuff. Yeah, let's just add smelter like these. And it will... Oh, no, it won't connect it quite. Ah, but it doesn't matter because we can have other things over here. Yes. Uh, mm, let's get these guys. Um, as it is, we have way too many warehouses. We really don't need this many. But let's put in even more. So, none, none. I really like this uh, QOL, the whole, like... The buildings glow if they're attached to power and stuff. I think that's fantastic. Really makes it easy for the player to understand what's going on here. All right, so science, let's get some stuff. We need to have a golem part factory. Wow, there are three different parts. There's an assembler. Okay, how big? What is this? Yeah, let's get all the bits and pieces. Um, then we need a charging station. How big is that? Oh, it's tiny. Okay. Control tower. Yes, we'll take all of this crap. Everything. Okay, good. So we can have golems doing stuff. So golem part factory. We need, oh my god, they're big. Oh boy. Okay, we can have two here. One and almost two. But we need a little bit of a roof. Okay. Let's get that again here. Golem part factory. Yep, there. And then we can get this. So those are connected together and they are straddling this area, which is perfect. Okay, and then what does the assembler look like again? That is a 3x3, three three. okay. I kind of want it in this area because it makes sense to have it. So what I'm going to do is, what are we going to do? This is a very big drop-off. I think we're just going to add platforms is what we're going to do. Uh, maybe not that one, not needed. So let's get that one going. Golem part, golem assembly. Now I've never used these golems before. I have no idea 
if they are wanted, needed for... I mean, I know they're needed for certain things, but I don't exactly know what things. So, I mean, obviously the sand or the, the terrain excavation, that says only works with golems, right? Terrain blocks, terraforming station, golem only. Golem only for dirt piles, dirt excavators, also golem only. So we have these kind of interesting bits and pieces here that we can work on. So let's see, this one is going to do a chassis. This one can do the limbs. Okay, good, good. And then we have heads, golem heads. <laughs> that sounds funny. Okay, how are we doing in our new, new colony? Oh, this is uh, interesting. Okay. Ah, it's because there's no staircases. Yeah, that's kind of rough. Why are they not getting planks? Oh, I forgot we're in a, in a plankless phase. Whoops. But they should be having... How many planks do we have here? 33. Hmm. I think that should be enough. Maybe we need another plank factory here. That would not go amiss, that's for sure. Let's just make another plank factory, another lumber mill. Mm -hmm. And in the home city state thingy, we have plenty of eager beavers with nothing to do. That's unfortunate. Even now we have, oh, you know what we could do? We could build another labor thingy, a labor hut or whatever it's called. The labor hut. Um, where do we put it, though? That's the hard question, really. We could delete some of these potatoes to put another labor hauling hut here. I think it might be nice and or needed. So let's just do that. Let's just get rid of this and put in a labor hut there. Hauling post. Sorry. It's called a hauling post. We apologize for the inconvenience. So, all right, so that stuff is going to get built, and we're going to need a ton of power, I bet, for this. 150, 150. These guys, of course, are 200 each. Another 150 and 250. But we should have wheels for this. Good, good. We actually have both of them, which is nice, and then we don't have room for another. So this is the end of the power up here. How is the power down here going? It is struggling because of lack of planks. Anyway, I think I think right now is a good time to wow, 25. That's fantastic. I don't think I've ever gotten that high. Um, but anyway, I think we're doing pretty well right now. Unconnected buildings, which are those that one? Really? Oh, I forgot to build the staircase. It's inconvenient. Okay. I should look at these notifications every now and again. It seems important. Um, power unconnected. This one. Okay, this one. Yeah, we know about that one. What about this thing? Her. Oh, okay. Sure. Take that. And where is the road on this here? It is here. Okay. That's fine. And then... That one, that one, that one, that one. Okay. Yep. Wait, is this one also unconnected? Oh, that one in the top one. Okay, that's fine. Yep. All right, cool. We got it. Fantastic. So anyway, we're surviving. Let's... Uh, actually, we'll pause so that we can... Get these beaver wheels running these also might be like lowest priority or something like that because we can always use them to charge stuff you know we could okay so there we go the undesirables working hard for us uh we need to make sure also that the batteries are charged every year or every cycle i haven't been paying attention to that so much anyway though Thank you so very much for joining me. Take care of yourselves and each other, and I'll see you next time.